it is used to transcribe the content of audio in mp3 to text. What you have to do is to upload your mp3 file, save it with a recorder and wait for the results, which not always are optimal, but they are very interesting. It works with several formats, but they have to be files of 3 MB max. Therefore, it is a small online tool that can be used for short It is used to dictate texts that are transcribed. It has the advantage that it offers a link to the formatting commands. Something useful for learning how you should dictate things like the period, comma, new lines, hyphen, or other punctuation marks or elements. Another peculiarity is that the result is shown to you on a virtual sheet of paper, with options to edit the resulting text. Below, you also have options to copy the text, save it in your PC, print it, or tweet it. You don't need to register anywhere to use it. It is perfect for when you want to dictate a transcription in mobile apps. Since the keyboard itself has a button with a microphone icon to start the dictation, what the keyboard does is to send what you are saying to Google Live and it returns a transcript. The advantage is that for being the mobile keyboard you can use the function in any app. It is available for Android and iOS. Its operation is simple, just speak and what is heard will be transcribed on the screen. The resulting notes can be changed by modifying the background color, the font, or its size.